hello everyone so today i am going to work on in the inventory the left-handed weapons so for now i only have the shield so i can equip the shield go back and into the right hand i can equip a sword or if i equip the great sword shield is removed that is something we had already worked on so yeah our focus is this right hand weapon options so all right so let's see how to do that today so here instead of creating a widget from scratch for the left-handed weapons i'm going to create a child widget of this uh, left-handed weapon of the right hand weapons that we have and reuse it as the left hand weapon options widget and i'll show you how to do that in this episode and before we get started i'd like to remind you you can download the project files of this project and all other thousands of projects that i have done from my patreon page and also this is a part of this action rpg with gameplay ability system series so feel free to check out all other episodes as well i'll leave the link in description below and uh, let's get back to today's episode all right so right now uh here now we have worked on this oh main weapon or primary weapon and it's working but for the secondary weapon or the shield we don't have a proper system yet so that's what we are going to work on today because here all we have is just a image that act as the placeholder of the widget that we need to have all right now let's go to UI and widget left hand weapons so this is what we have but we in the widget right hand weapons here now we have implemented all the functions that we need in order to show all the items available here in this scrollable area so it would be better if i can reuse this widget instead of having to recreate the same code in this widget so let me rename this oh sorry this is correct mm, left hand pass alt because I'm going to create a new one here that's why I rename it as old so uh, I need to create a child of this class but for some reason it's directly not showing create a child class option here so let's go to blueprint and now as the parent under all classes I'll select WDG right hand weapons WDG left hand weapons okay now this is same as the right hand weapons UI except you you are not allowed to modify any of these elements in the interface in the designer view but we can manipulate them through the code so to do that here if i open the right hand weapons we have anchored this to this here uh, uh, position of oh, where to make things simpler i'll make the alignment 2.5 so we have to give the position from the left edge to the middle of the widget uh, of the scroll box so how much it should be let's try 300 okay and if i anchor this here i will have to make this minus 300 
yeah so this is the position that i need to put this if my if i am showing the options or choices that i have for the left-handed weapons in the ui i need it to be in this side so let's do that here in the pre should I do it here uh, I, this is not a variable so scroll box I make it a variable then we can access it from here scroll now get slot has canvas panel slot now we can modify mm, say anchor so i need to anchor it to the top right split that means like this and then i need to set position to 272 let's make this 270 so here minus 300 and 270 and compile now it's in the correct position and also we need to change the background image so yeah this is the image mg pg that's it's already available and we need to change this image so Get img bg set brush from texture and the texture is which one second one okay this one And compile but we have this in the background so actually I have modified it in externally so if I import this those are gone yeah because I had it already edited out those so icons that was there okay now the widget is there correct done so how do we use this instead of the old one we had? Um, let me save everything. Select both. Set actions. Can we replace references? Select this. Consolidate and make writable and delete all right let's see we have errors that's fine okay what's the variable type oh it's changed to object so this should be left oh is the widget left hand weapons okay all right now what's this returning okay this to widget 
good. Menu, I also we have it as. Let's check. Right, all fixed. Yeah, now we have the correct widget just like this. Yeah, now the only thing we are remaining to do is initializing these options. So, how can we do that? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, bear by okay init options this is what we need to do when i switch to left hand weapon inventory i can use the same thing because this is a child of right hand weapons so ability g left hand weapons but here I only want to show the shield I'll change that later on later first let me see if it works yeah we got the weapon and we can apply them also we need to modify the camera but first here now let me remove this is for the left hand. I remove great sword. And the sword. And from here I remove the shield. Okay. Now here we only have the sword and uh, well this too uh, its positioning is wrong here we have this okay so how do I change the camera left hand this is the camera right hand this is the camera so right hand the length is 200 this also I'll make it 200 okay Right hand we have a rotation and an offset. Yeah. Let's make it one sixty and hundred. Yeah, I think that's okay. the alignment issue of the boxes uh, buttons I think making this left align should fix it let's see ah yeah it's fixed it okay now yeah we can stop this episode right here so thanks for watching as always, updated bullet files will be available for the download. 
in the patron page link will be in the description below and next time maybe we will work on uh, correcting the cameras based on the weapon size because when I equip the uh, great sword it's out of the screen maybe I need to work on that yeah let's see and see you in the next episode and don't forget to like and subscribe goodbye